What's going on everybody? I'm back with another High Limit Coin Buster video for you all today. And in today's video we're going to be doing a $5 million buy-in. And they gave us 500 quarters to get started today. A pretty expensive game, so I wish me good luck. Hopefully we can walk out of here with a humongous win. My goodness, they got this thing loaded up brilliantly well today. There's like a ginormous uh, wall made out of $10,000 chips and uh, one ounce gold bars. We got a quarter pyramid right there in the center, two quarter towers, whole bunch of five and $10,000 chip towers. I got a couple gold towers way back there in the back on the blue shelf, so they got it loaded up super good. And uh, last but not least, ginormous tower of uh, $25,000 chips back there on the pusher. I'd say that right there is probably like a, at least a seven, eight, nine, ten million dollar tower possibly. We definitely have the potential to make way over five million dollars back today so wish me good luck. Oh yeah, nice that wall starting to break a little bit. Oh yeah, we're about to get a whole bunch of quarters right there. Nice, what I tell you. That was a huge push. Nice, there we go. We got the quarter tower on the left-hand side. That is what I'm talking about. Oh my goodness, that is awesome. Oh yeah, I can already tell you this is going to be a super good game today. Nice, we got another tower to go on the right. Sweet. And one on the left. My goodness. And yeah, we're winning so many uh, $10,000 chips. Nice, there we go. It's doing super, super well. Yeah, uh, they told me two other people had uh, played this before I got here. And each one did a $5 million buy-in. They put their 500 quarters in there and didn't win anything back at all. So it was primed and ready to go. So, uh... Nice, there it goes. We got the quarter tower on the right-hand side. That is what I'm talking about. Oh my goodness, that is awesome. Yeah, we're definitely going to make out like a bandit today, that's for sure. Definitely going to make a fortune off of this game. Nice, there we go. We got another tower of uh, $10,000 chips. Yeah, we could really, really use a nice uh, profit on this game today. Because I played uh, one other game before this one. And, uh, or actually two games. Uh, we lost quite a bit on those, so... Well, I might as well go ahead and say it. We're down about $23 million at the moment, so that's what we need to profit on this game right here to break even today. So anyhow, uh, that right there was the last of our 500 quarters, so uh, let's go round up the quarters. We'll get right back to pushing. Alrighty, we're back. Let's get right back to pushing. So that previous round was super, super successful. We made a tremendous amount of money. We got quite a bit of quarters now also. I think we're up to about uh, 17 or 1800 quarters. So we're doing super, super good today. So uh, I'm just going to push right there in the center. Try to get that enormous tower of $25,000 chips to fall down. Yeah, there is uh, six chips in a circle. And so if you want to uh, just count up how many chips, and how many rows of chips are on that tower, uh, you're welcome to do that. And then just uh, multiply that by six. Now let's see. Well, there is uh, two hundred and fifty thousand dollars on each uh, row of chips. So if you want to just count all of it up, you're welcome to. Well, nice. We got five grand on the right. That's pretty good. So, uh, sorry if I don't sound super, super enthusiastic today. I'm just really, really tired. A little bit sleepy. I went to bed super, super late last night. I think it was like 3 in the morning or something. Or it was probably closer to like 4 in the morning. So, uh, yeah, I stayed up really, really late editing uh, the video that I posted this morning and stuff. Oh my goodness, nice, there we go, we got the John Ormus Tower of $25,000 chips. It all got stuck in the loot chute though, so let's get it cleared out. 
Oh my goodness, I don't think I've ever seen so many $25,000 chips in my life. That was insane. It was just like raining $25,000 chips down there. And I, and I think I seen a $1 chip hidden in there. So that $1 chip is worth 500 free quarters. So I'll get to turn that in. They'll give me a bonus uh, 500 quarters. That is wonderful. Now we could really, really use those extra quarters because we're going to need a lot of quarters to get all this stuff out of here today. Oh, and they also got uh, two ginormous uh, dollar sign money mister bags on the blue shelves. Check those out. Hopefully those are loaded up super good. Oh yeah, we're about to get all them $25,000 chips out there. Nice, what I tell you, we got the majority of them. I'd say we're easily making like probably a hundred grand every single push. That's like the average amount. Well, now we're not really going to make too much unless we get the towers of ten thousand dollar chips to go. Well, we might get this one over here on the left though. So uh, I probably won't push too much more just because our quarters are limited. And I would like to cash in the $1 chip first, and then uh, we'll get back to pushing. But uh, anyway, they got quite a bit of stuff on the blue shelves today. Like I said, there's just uh, $5,000 chip towers, gold towers. Uh, the remaining $10,000 chips in gold from that wall, there's two of those on the blue shelves. And the mystery bags. So there's multiple ways we could get all that stuff. The first way, I'd have to win a $5 chip or a red earbud. If we win either one of those two, we'll get to turn that in. They will uh, put all that stuff into the playing field. But if that's not in there, uh, we'd have to pay two times the original buy-in. And uh, they would take all that stuff, they'd put it into the play field for us. So, so yeah, hopefully that uh, $5 chip was hidden in there with the $1 chips. I didn't see it whenever it fell. Y'all might have seen it. If you've seen it, just uh, let me know the timestamp down in the comments when you've seen it fall down. I mean, I'll probably see it later on whenever I am uh, editing this video. So anyway, this is going to be the second video for today. I thought about doing two videos in one day for a long time, and uh, I'm going to give that a try today. So, uh... Yeah, I posted a video early this morning, like I said, it was a one quarter challenge with a hundred thousand dollar buy-in, so if you missed that video, I highly suggest you go and check it out after you're done watching this one. It was a super, super good game, we made a huge profit from a hundred grand, so yeah, go and check out that video after you're done watching this one, but uh, yeah, this right here is going to be the second video for today. And I've missed uh, quite a few days in uh, 2023 and stuff, and I wanted to make up some of those days that I missed. So I've been posting a lot of like YouTube Shorts videos, like the short uh, 30 to 60 second videos. It's not like the full video or anything, but usually I will uh, post those YouTube Shorts like... Uh, after I post the main video or something like that so I mean you don't have to watch those if you don't want to but I mean I don't see why you wouldn't want to watch them they're like short uh, videos of nothing but towers falling down guess we need to be pushing on that uh, left hand side don't we oh yeah that towers going it's teetering back and forth oh yeah it's going to go I think any second now now, like I said, we do have limited quarters, so I'm trying not to pile up the quarters too much. Nice, we got it. So I think that is a perfect stopping point right there because it's going to take a lot of quarters to get that one on the right. So anyway, uh, let's go uh, check the payout chute and see how many special chips we've won. I know for a fact I've seen a $1 chip. So I'll let y'all know what we've won so far. Be right back. You all are not going to believe this. Check this out. We got that $5 chip and there was five $1 chips hidden in there. 
So the $5 chip will get to turn that in. Like I said, they'll take everything that is on the blue shelf, so they'll put it into the playing field. And this right here is 2,500 free quarters because each one of these is worth 500 free quarters. So that is absolutely amazing. So I think I'm going to go ahead and turn in all these chips right here. They'll take everything that's on the blue shelf, so put it into the playing field. And they'll give me 2,500 more quarters, so we'll be right back. Alrighty, we're back. Let's get right back to pushing. So I turned in that $5 chip. And all five of those uh, $1 chips, they gave me 2,500 more quarters. And they took all the towers, the chips, and the gold that was on the blue shelf. So they put it all into the playing field. Uh, looks like they combined most of the $10,000 chips into like one ginormous uh, tower back there on the pusher. So hopefully we can get that thing to go. Looks like it's pretty sturdy, I guess. So it might take a little bit of quarters to get it to go. But that's alright. As long as we can eventually get it out of there. I guess that's all that matters. Nice, there we go. We got the two Mr. Bags. Sweet. Wow, that is awesome sauce. Let's get them out of the loot chute. All right, there we go. So, yeah, I will check out those Mr. Bags here in just a second. All right, so that was like probably half a basket of quarters at once. Let's see what it does. Oh, nice. We got another tower on the right side to go. Sweet. All right, let's dump a whole entire basket of quarters in there at once again see what happens. Well, if I can get them in there, I'm spilling all of them. Yeah, it's too difficult to use the skill stop and rapid fire at the same time. Especially if there's a lot of quarters in the basket to begin with. Nice, there it goes. We got the humongous tower that was on the pressure back there. That is absolutely incredible. Wow, look at all that money we're winning. That is just insane. All right, this is doing absolutely amazing. So uh, let's just use the skill stop and put a bunch of quarters in there like normal. How does that sound? So uh, anyway, how's everybody's day going today? Hope y'all are doing well and having an awesome day so far. Uh, remember if this is your first time watching my channel and you're enjoying this super super amazing video right here and you want to see more videos like this every single day seven days a week uh, be sure you hit that thumbs up button it would really help out the video and uh, be sure you're subscribed to the channel and have the bell icon enabled that way you get notified for whenever I post a brand new video help out tremendously we're on the road to 150,000 subscribers and my goal was to get there by today actually February the 1st so uh, well, we still got a little over uh, 4,000 subscribers to go to get to that 150,000 mark so unfortunately we was not able to get to 150,000 subscribers by the 1st of February so I'm just going to erase that goal completely but now my main goal is to get to 200,000 subscribers by the end of this year. So that's the next goal right there. 200,000 subscribers by the end of this year. We got technically 11 more months to do that. So uh, hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. I mean, it would really just help you all out. I'm not making, like, any uh, money when you all subscribe or nothing. It's just making it easier for you to uh, keep up with the brand new videos. So you can't beat that. It's a win-win uh, both ways. And I really reward you all for uh, hitting the like button and uh, leaving nice comments and subscribing to the channel. The better the content does, uh, the better the video is the next day. So the more likes we can get, the more subscribers we can get, the more uh, comments we can get, the video the next day is always a little bit better. So, so if you want to uh, just spam that like button, let's try to get to, uh, let's see, 10,000 likes. Let's see if we can get to 10,000 likes today, that'd be incredible. 
Well, we definitely got this thing piled up with quarters now. Look at how many quarters is in the play field. That is just insane. And that loot chute is super, super piled up. We'll get that cleared out. And I might play that in slow motion for you all. How does that sound? All those quarters falling out of there. Just play it in slow motion. We got to open up the mystery bags also. I will uh, get those out of the loot chute here in just a moment. And anyway, I'm just trying to focus on that right hand side and try to get those two poker chip towers. And I'm uh, really, really hoping there's some more special chips hidden in the mystery bags today. Like a $10 chip, $50 chip, 5,000 slash 10,000 chip would be nice. Because this game right here, it's going to be short if we don't get another special chip. I've been playing this game about an hour and 13 minutes. No, wait, an hour and 16 minutes is what I meant to say. What the camera says, anyway. So, uh, but anyway, most of that was getting the loot chute cleared out and separating the quarters and stuff. But usually, on average, I have around four hours wrapped up in a game, so. Yeah, it doesn't take, well, let's just say it takes a lot of time to, uh, get all that, uh, towers and stuff like that out of there not an easy game most of the time and a lot of times I'll be doing like buy-in after buy-in just trying to make my money back and uh, doesn't always work out I definitely lose a lot more of these than I win so just thought I should throw that out there because I know a lot of people still assume that I just win at these every single time and stuff, but that's really not the reality of the situation. Because you all are seeing uh, the absolute best video of the day. You're not seeing the games where the towers are being stubborn, where the towers won't fall down at all. You're seeing the games with the biggest towers, the biggest win, and the biggest profit, so... Yeah, I mean, I might start posting the losing videos here within the future. So let me know if you'd want to see some losing videos. Maybe uh, one losing video a day and one winning video a day. Or should I just combine it into one video? Let me know down in the comments. Alright, well look at how piled up the front of the machine is now. That loose shoot is severely clogged up. Wow, I don't think it's ever been uh, that piled up before. I uh, tell you what, let me uh, point the camera down a little bit more so you can see all this stuff. Yeah, look at all that right there. That is insane. So I'm going to get that loot chute cleared out. So get ready for the world's largest uh, waterfall with quarters. Are you ready? Oh my goodness, that was absolutely insane, holy moly. Alrighty, I'm back. So I hope y'all enjoyed that uh, waterfall of quarters and stuff. So anyhow, let's go ahead and open up the mystery bags. Let's go ahead and start with this one over here on the right, see if there's any nice and valuable items in there. Feels like it's loaded up super good, so let's see what we got. Oh my goodness, I think we got the $10 chip and a whole bunch of dice. Oh my goodness, wow. So this $10 chip right here, we'll get to turn this in. And they'll let me spin a wheel. And that wheel has all these different types of chip values on there. And whatever it lands on, that's what type of brand new tower they'll build somewhere in the machine. So that is incredible. And we also got a Bitcoin. So that is one entry into the $300,000 buy-in giveaway. And let's see, how many dice did we win? Looks like uh, six of the white dice. One silver dice and one gold dice. So the white dice, we get to roll them, whatever they land on. My winnings will multiply by those numbers. The gold dice, that would multiply our gold. And that silver dice right there, that would multiply our quarters. Wow, that is absolutely exceptional right there. So now let's move on to this other Mr. Bag. Uh, hopefully this one is loaded up just as good, if not better. So let's check it out and see what we got. Oh my goodness, well there's something else in there. Wow, check this out. We got the Mr. Money keychain. So this right here could be worth a dollar all the way up to one billion dollars. And I actually won one of these, I think, on the episode before the last one. And uh, I forgot to tell you all what it was worth. Well, the other day it was worth one thousand dollars. So hopefully it's worth a lot more than that today. 
And we got another Bitcoin, so that's another entry into that free giveaway, free $100,000 buying giveaway. We got three more white dice, two more gold dice, and another silver dice. So, yeah, this right here is definitely going to be a huge win for a $5 million buy-in, that's for sure. So I think we should go ahead and uh, turn in that $10 chip. And we're going to spin that wheel and whatever it lands on, that's what type of brand new tower they'll build in there somewhere. So we'll be right back. Alrighty, Andy Coinbrush, your has your turn. Let's get right back to pushing. So I turned in that $10 chip and I got to spin that wheel. And today it landed on one ounce gold bars. As you can see, they built a gigantic tower of gold back there on the pusher. That thing is humongous. My goodness, look at all those quarters we're winning. Yeah, I think I messed up. I was going to try to uh, win some of these quarters back after I go separate the chips and stuff that was at the loot shoot down there. After I got through with that, I was going to play and try to win some quarters back before I cashed in that $10 chip, but I forgot all about it, and I just turned in that $10 chip, so... But luckily, they did not take any of the quarters off of the play field. See, sometimes... If there's any like quarters on the play field and they want to uh, make room for the towers, they will literally just like take all the quarters that are stacked up off of the play field and they won't give them back to me. They'll just keep the quarters for themselves. So, uh, but luckily they just decided to build a tower on the pusher and not on the lower shelf. We still got to get them two towers on the right side though really really hoping we can uh, win those well, that gold tower it's like going back and forth I don't know it might end up falling backwards who knows we'll just have to wait and see come on big money oh yeah there's a gold bar out there getting close to the edge so anyway, I would like to give a shout out to a coin pusher. His name is Joe. He does amazing high limit coin pusher videos. If you have not seen his channel before, I highly suggest you go and check it out. He does lots of uh, expensive buy-ins and stuff. So uh, yeah, his channel is very, very entertaining to watch. So go and check it out. It's called a coin pusher. And he's trying to get to 150,000 subscribers also. I think he has uh, 144,000 subscribers at the moment, or it might be 145,000, I can't really remember, but it's something around there. So let's see if we can get Joe to 150,000 subscribers. Oh my goodness, wow! Nice, we got that John Lomas Tower gold to fall down, that is absolutely brilliant. Oh my goodness, and we're also about to get the $10,000 chip tower over there on the right. Tell you what, should we uh, go ahead and load this thing up with quarters using the skill stop? I feel like that's a really, really good idea, actually, so let's go ahead and do that. Try to get them stacked up over there on the right. Alright, that was about 150 of them, I guess. Wow, it's just raining gold right there in the center. So now I'm going for that tower of $10,000 chips that's on the right corner. Hopefully we can get that thing to go. Oh nice, the $5,000 chip tower right beside of it just moved on up a little bit. It's moving on up. Oh yeah, it just moved again. Now this is going to be an excellent jackpot win today, I can already guarantee you that. We've already made way over $5 million, but uh... We got all those dice we get to roll. We could turn like, say, 10 million in chips into a couple hundred million dollars today, potentially. So, but yeah, let's keep it pushing on the right. We're going to have to stack up the quarters. We're going to get them towers on the right anytime soon. But yeah, uh, let me know how much gold do you think I've won today down in the comments. I think we've at least won. 150, 200 ounces of gold possibly. Well, I don't know about 200 ounces of gold, but at least 100 and some. Yeah, but I'll count up all the gold at the very end of this game right here. I'll let y'all know what we've won. 
Oh no, well our quarters got stuck back there. They'll break free eventually. And uh, let me know if you'd want to see uh, more limited quarter games or more like uh, 1,000 quarter challenge videos. Just uh, let me know down in the comments. Just leave me a whole bunch of suggestions for videos you'd want to see. And if you have any suggestions for like uh, towers that could be built in here, just let me know and I will show the staff your all suggestions. And uh, who knows, it might make it into a brand new video. Nice, there we go. We got the $10,000 chip tower. Now let's uh, push that tower $5,000 chips out of there. It's not really on the corner, so it should be a lot easier to win. Oh yeah, you see what I'm saying? It's moving forward really, really quick now. Got a $10,000 chip right there. Oh yeah, it's almost there. It's getting real close. Come on, big push. Wow, this is an intense battle right here, that's for sure. So we're kind of getting low on quarters again, so uh, I'll have to go down there and round up some quarters. But uh, right, Well, that right there was the rest of the quarters. We don't have any left in the basket. Oh yeah, that tower's going to go probably on that push right there or the next one so uh, let's go collect some quarters we'll get right back to work alrighty we're back let's get right back to pushing so I asked them uh, how much that Mr. Money keychain was worth uh, probably about half an hour ago but I just forgot to tell you all uh, they said it was worth uh, $3,000 today yeah it was $3,000 so I mean, that's two grand more than it was worth uh, a couple days ago so I'll take it Three grand is pretty good, and just so you know, the white dice will uh, multiply the value of that Mr. Money keychain. The white dice multiply the chips, the cash, and the value of the keychain, so just thought I should point that out there. So uh, after we get that last uh, 30 grand on the right, we'll have the whole entire machine cleared out. And we got that tower a couple seconds ago. Sorry I didn't point that out. How does it fail? I was explaining about that uh, keychain and stuff. Yeah, this has been a incredible game today. Can't believe that we got all the towers to go this quick. And the camera says I've been playing for uh, three hours, uh, four minutes, and two seconds. So I mean, that's a pretty fast game in my opinion. Because like I said, on average, it's about four hours a game. Most of the time, it's close to five hours. But if you count all the short games and stuff, I guess it averages out to be like four hours a game. So, yeah, this has been a spectacular game today. So, uh, hit that like button if you've enjoyed the video. Let's try to get to 10,000 likes today on this episode. Nice, we got it. We got the whole entire machine cleared out today. That is absolutely remarkable. It's been a marvelous game today, absolutely marvelous. So now I'm going to go ahead and call them back here. I think we have won 14 dice in total. We got nine of the white dice, uh, three of the gold dice, and two of the silver dice. They'll put all 14 of them dice back there on the pusher. And we have to roll them on down to that lower play field. Whatever they all land on, we get to multiply our winning center gold and our quarters by those numbers. So let's call them over here and we'll get right back to pushing. Alrighty, I'm back. Let's get right back to pushing. So I called them over here. And they uh, put all 14 of them dice on the pusher, so let's roll them on down to that lower shelf. Hopefully they all end on some fabulous numbers today. Oh my goodness, they're doing super, super good. So we do got to be careful though, because that four over there on the right, it's about to fall down that gutter, like probably two or three pushes away from falling down in the gutter. And we would lose the dice if they fell down the gutters or over the edge, so we're going to have to be extremely careful. Oh no, we just lost that four. Well, I was wrong. It was really one push away from going, but that's all right. Uh, somebody else will get that dice if they win that $50 chip. So anyhow, this still should be a pretty nice win today. The majority of them dice landed on some pretty good numbers. So I'm going to count everything up, multiply our winnings and our gold and our quarters by all that. And I'll let y'all know how much money we have made today. 
from a five million dollar buy-in. I'll be right back. You all are not going to believe how much money I have won today. This is absolutely insane. I ended up winning nineteen million eight hundred and thirty-eight thousand dollars. That is the chips and that mystery money keychain combined. And all the white dots totaled up to 28, so I got to multiply my winnings by 28. And in total, I ended up winning $555,464,000 from a $5 million buy-in. Holy mackerel, I am shocked right now. I was not expecting to win anywhere near that amount of money today. I am amazed right now. That is just insane. That is a massive, humongous, life-changing win today indeed. Absolutely marvelous. And on top of that, we won, I believe it was 128 ounces of gold. And uh, the gold dice totaled up to, I believe it was 13. So we got to multiply the gold by 13. And in total, I ended up winning 1,664 ounces of gold today. Spot price of gold is like $2,060 an ounce at the moment. So that means we got an extra $3,427,840 in gold. That is absolutely outstanding. And we also won, I believe it was uh, 4,093 quarters. And both of those silver dice combined totaled up to 11. So we're going to get to multiply the quarters by 11. And in total, I ended up winning 45,023 quarters. So let's divide that by four to get the dollar amount. That means we got $11,255.75 in quarters today. That is incredible. And on top of that, we won, I believe it was uh, two of the Bitcoins. So that is two entries into the free $100,000 buy-in giveaway. So that right there is not bad, not bad at all for a $5 million buy-in. So if y'all enjoyed today's episode, uh, please consider hitting that like button, and hitting the subscribe button, and turn on the bell icon. That way you get notified for whenever I post a brand new video. And also, if you want to check out a whole entire playlist of my videos, that will appear at the bottom right of the screen. And if you want to check out uh, yesterday's video, the previous video, that will appear on the bottom left of the screen. And if you want to check out one of CoinPresser's videos, that will appear at the top left of the screen. And if you want to subscribe to my channel and check out some other videos that I've done, uh, you can click that button at the top right of the screen there. So with all that being said, I will see everybody on the next episode. Y'all take care and have a fabulous day.